Good morning, good morning. I hope everybody is doing well. And I'm really, really chuffed today because I own about 860,000 of these coins. And uh, it's what's roughly around about £10,000 worth. And the coin is Jasmine. I can't believe it. It's like I woke up this morning and I've seen what the price was. I haven't checked it in for such a long time. Uh, and it's just mooned. Uh, we'll get into that in a bit, why, why I think it's mooned. But yeah, it's really good because like I said, I've been holding it for about a year and a half now and it hasn't really done anything until yesterday but anyway what we've got some really big news happening today it, it, this could be a market changer this might change how things are at the moment but we've got out of the big seven on the on the stocks we've got nvidia's uh, q4 earnings coming out so this is going to be a real big one because we know how uh, nvidia's been playing out and i'll get into that in a second but actually Bitcoin has dropped down. The bears are out. The bears have said we're going lower and lower and lower. We we're at 51,000. But we're down like a percent. You know, it wasn't that long ago where we were sort of at 48,000. And then we suddenly boosted back up again. Uh, and now the bears are coming out because we dropped down a percent. Like, you know, but just always be aware. We could go back down to, what, 48% and retest there. But at the moment, we're still staying at $51,408. Obviously, as I said with the video, it could could change uh, a few things today you know if it's good results and the video starts going pumping up even more because it's gone parabolic as it is you know that's going to be good for the markets but you've got to be careful sometimes because i find with stocks that you can get some good news you know and actually for some unknown reason we just start dropping down but anyway we've just got to be mindful of that today uh, that's coming out and do not also forget we've got the um FOMC minutes coming out as well, so just be aware of that. But at the moment, we've got like the crypto market at 1.96 trillion. Hasn't really changed much, but Bitcoin, you know, is sitting at 51,391 as of making this video sort of thing. But, you know, we've got like, you know, Bitcoin at the moment. Well, I am watching this very carefully. This is on the four hour. We've got this wedge here. We're certainly starting to break down a little bit. Hopefully the bulls could come back in, reclaim that and move straight up. But we've got this bit of resistance here at that round about that fifty two and a half thousand dollar mark. You know, but obviously we've got that support down here at that forty eight thousand. I said we could go down to there, but just keeping a very close eye on this wedge at the moment. And I'm watching also what's going to happen with that nvidia today because obviously we can see nvidia this is on the monthly you know it's it's rocketed from what this is like one of those crypto isn't it like you know you know, going for about three dollars all the way up to 724 dollars so we're starting to come up to resistance on the monthly here so obviously depending what today just be careful like i said you could get some really good earnings come out but we could suddenly drop down to the downside. So, yeah, you just got to be aware of that. It's not always you always get this good news, good earnings, and we pump. For some unknown reason, sometimes in the stocks, they can drop down. So just be careful of that. And obviously, that could bring down a lot of the market. If we come down, that could bring down a lot of the markets, including crypto as well. So just be aware of that. Uh, in that because don't forget like i said we've got the new nvidia q4 earnings will be a referendum on the ai trade revenue expected to jump 234 percent good news could be coming out but just be aware and be careful out there especially if you're trading uh in that but we can now go have a quick look at the uh the bubbles here if it reloads it doesn't seem to always want to reload but it reloaded now yeah it's pretty much like a sea of red at the moment on the hourly uh, and then on the two day, uh, on the daily, so to say, on the, it's basically, yeah, just a bit of sea red with the odd uh, green uh, bubbles there. So, uh, couldn't get my word out. So, yeah, bit of a fuzzy mind today. Got, not feeling too great. Got like a bit of a, uh, a cold. I only had a cold like about a week ago and I've got it again. Uh, but, yeah, so looking all good on that one. But the, like I said, crypto market at the moment is looking pretty dandy fear and greed is 78 it's extreme greed so like i said that might change at some point today i don't know we'll soon see uh but i can't believe it jasmine coin uh pumping up absolutely really mega pumped 125 percent on the month i, I couldn't i could not I, to be honest with you i really could not believe it uh, when I saw that, it's like I said, I've been sitting on it for such a long time, uh, and it's done that. You know, I've, I've not taken any kind of profits at the moment. I'm not going to take no profits 
because I have a long-term conviction of this. I've got about 860,000 coins I own. Uh, and like I said, currently sitting at $10,000. Now, I'm not taking anything out because, like I said, I'm looking at a wider area where it could go to. You know, could it get to a dollar? Could it get to a dollar? Well, there's nothing to stop it. You know, if we go parabolic in this bull run, uh, Bitcoin goes scraps and crazy, goes above, you know, all time highs, and you know, and we get these parabolic moves. You know, am I expecting that we could get to a dollar? You know, let me know in the comments. What do you think Jasmine Coin would get to? Because I really do think it's going to go to dollar, but I couldn't believe the move. And if you're not too sure what actually uh, Jasmine, before I go to a bit more of the charts, what Jasmine Coin is. You just go to the website, you can check it out. It's the, the purpose of the on technology. Basically, Jasmine Coin operates on an Oak 20 token deployed on the Ethereum blockchain. It serves, uh, it serves as basically a main utility token within the Jasmine network. The project aims to address basically challenges related to date privacy and ownership in digital age. Jasmine combines uh, uh, technology, blockchain technology, to create a secure environment where users are fully controlled over the personal information. The platform connects to two categories, service provider and data users. And I can go into a bit more details, but just go to the website. It will give you all that information. So why do I think this is really pumped up? Well, we've had this news. Uh, this is basically uh, from, uh, I forget his detail here. This is from Jasmine Thailand. The reason for Jasmine Pump today is the Japanese government allows our ILP investments fund can buy and hold crypto. P.S. Japan is the third largest economy in the world. What do you think? And it's giving all the information about the cabinet approved the bill, uh, particularly about the industry. And this is part of the reason why uh, Jasmine is basically uh, pumped up as well. That's what I'm thinking too. Uh, and, and obviously, this is what uh, uh, Jasmine Thailand is mentioning as well, which is mega bullish. You know, anything coming kind of like this is mega bullish. And uh, yeah, really shocked. That's a bit of profit. Uh, well, actually, it's not paper. It's paper profit, not real profit, because I haven't taken anything off the table. Uh, but I'm not going to take it off the table because this is like this is. If you look out now, the all time here, look where we were. This is like all time high. We go down to here, uh, right down the bottom somewhere. Where are we now? All time high was four dollars ninety nine. We're ninety nine point seven six percent from the all time high, and we can look at the market cap where we were, where we were at all-time high. We were all over $1.2 billion. And look at this, we're getting up to that $600 million. The thing is, people say, ah, you're never going to make it, you're never going to go to all-time high. Well, nobody can ever say for sure we're ever going to go back to all-time high. But there's also there's a possibility that we could get back to all-time high. And I'm holding on because, like I said, we, from all-time high, we're down 99 percent and now we're starting to make that move up and you know this could start getting traction as long as bitcoin holds the line and we start to get that alt coin alt season you know all the cards are on the table it's all you know and so you can't ever say no it's not do you think let me know in the comments below do you think jasmine coin is going to get to that one dollar mark uh, in this bull run or do you think we're going to go back to all time high of that $4 get back to that $1.2 billion mark are we going to get to that let me in the comments below what do you think I really do think though that $1 is definitely on the table and if it does wow my portfolio is going to explode just like other coins that I own like CRO PYR uh, D-Race you know, and XTP, you know, all of them are I, I own. And, you know, if they really all do explode, wow, I, you know, I'm going to, definitely going to be in the money, uh, this bull market. So, but yeah, Jasmine Coin, I, I bet you all you are out there who owe the Jasmine Coin are really chuffed at waking up to seeing this price. It's like, you know, it's gone from another day. And we've sort of basically just coming in at the moment into this basic consolidation rate. So we've had that big pump up, as we can say, on the on the uh, seven day. And now we're just consolidating at the moment because obviously, you know, Bitcoin's starting to pull back a little bit. And obviously, you know, it drags some of the ults with it. So I'm expecting it. But, you know, with Jasmine Coin, yeah, holding it for the long term, mega, mega bullish. Like you said, we're sort of up on the seven day. Can't grumble on that. And I expect good things to happen with Jasmine Coin uh, in the future. And we can just, like I said, if you want to get more details, 
you can get find out who the directors are and the CEOs, uh, and fully what they do. Uh, so like I said, yeah, I've been holding it for a long time. Going to continually to hold it for a long time, uh, specifically for this bull market. If, if we get to that dollar mark, or just even just below, I will start to take a little bit off the table uh, on that one. So yeah, but really mega bullish. But like I said, just be careful today because we are getting that Nvidia earnings, and you know anything could happen today. And don't forget also we've got the FOMC meetings coming out. We don't probably won't get that much of a movement, but we'll get a feel of what the committee uh, are thinking in the future about rate cuts and such like you know or pauses or whatever like you know we'll get that information so a lot of things happening today a lot of things could change how the market is playing out at the moment so keep an eye out if you're leverage trading just be careful but again congratulations to the jasmine coin holders and pat myself on the back all good all dandy anyway so i'll leave you to it like i said give us a thumbs up give us a subscribe it's always much appreciated and i'll see you soon in the next video take care